Baylor men's basketball team put their 46 game non conference home winning streak on the line this afternoon as they hosted Greg Marshall and the eighth ranked Wichita State Shockers. That's the second longest streak in the nation. The Ferrell Center was absolutely rocking for today's top 16 at showdown. Even Chip Gaines from Fixer Upper and his friend Bruiser were on hand for this one. First half action bears up one. King McClure drives to the basket. He gets the tough shot to fall. Bears up 19 16. McClure had 12 on the day. Game now tied at 19. Mono Comp throws up the three. It's good. The Bears take the 22 19 lead, but Wichita State would continue to keep it close. Under six left in the first half. LeCompte finds the big man, Nooney Omont, in the corner. He drains the triple, tying the game at 25. Bears trailed by four at the break. Second half now, Shockers extend their lead. Daryl Willis Jr. gets the steal and takes it the other way for the layup and the foul. Wichita State up 55 48. Baylor would battle back, though. McClure is going to find LeCompte, and Manu knocks down the tough three. 63 59 shockers on top and the bears would tie it up. Jake Lindsay drives to the basket, count it and the foul. He would make the free throw to tie the game at 62, but the shockers would prove to be too much. They would retake the lead and hang on to win 69 to 62. The final, the bears fall to six and two on the year. Our guys played uh, uh, um, really hard and they made 10 for 16 from three. We were five for 21. Uh, it's a big difference. Um, defensively, we could have done some things a little bit better to identify shooters or get out to them a little sooner, but you got to credit them for making the shots. This is a game that gets us better. Um, now we'll have a short turnaround, and hopefully we can get back to winning ways because nobody likes uh, uh, losing. The Bears will look to get back to winning ways on Tuesday when they host Sam Houston State at 7. We'll stay at the